State Forest right now and I uh, found a really cool looking spot on uh, satellite view so we're gonna go check that out it may be an absolute letdown but it also might be a bloody cracker of a spot it smells like actual poo in here I think I ran over a massive cow shit it's all we can smell I mean it's kind of cool you get this little like dead-end circular area where you park and it goes up the hill and then over that way you have a really nice view over the valley and then the spot is just kind of in that little bare circular area but there's not that much to look at so I'm gonna find another area. logs to try and make seats around the <laughs> Yeah, that would be cool actually. But it would take some work. We'd have to flatten a bit of area. The verdict is, it's a bit of a fixer-upper in there, so we're gonna come back when we have more people. And uh, yeah, it'll be a bit easier to clear out. Last spot, I hope you like it. You like it? Yeah. I do like this like idea of putting my tent under here. And it's cool, look at this Miller. See in this pit, you can make the fire pit there and then you sit up on the grass here. Yeah. That's kind of cool I reckon. I think that's what we should do. It's been looking rainy for a while, but nothing. What is your project? I'm going to set up the hammock between these two trees, probably. And there's also going to be some flat ground out the back there where I'll put the tarp up and we can put all our gear under the tarp. I just spent the past hour cutting down all the dead branches and stuff from these trees uh, and then I cleared the area so that it's not all mushy and put all your gear on the floor and then in the back between these four trees I'm going to clear that, flatten it and put up a tarp above and we'll put all of our food and whatnot in there. You know, after all this time clearing, I think these trees are so thick that it's cut off half my rope length. I don't know if the hammock will actually reach. That's really nice. Book. So we're gonna try it, and if it doesn't work, what I'm thinking is, it's really thick branches here, and one on that side, and I'm hoping that can hold the weight of the hammock. We shall see. It will reach. No. <laughs> yeah, it's not reaching. <laughs> it's still too. Oh, no, no, it's perfect. So glad I've learned these knots. It's actually so amazing how 
how much easier this process is when you know what you're doing. Like your little bunny ears. Yeah, that's what I was doing. I was doing bunny ears at first. Alton has like a PDF handbook thing and you can get the PDF and it just shows you how to do all the different knots. It's amazing. That feels pretty good. Just knowing I'm free from the mosquitoes and I can just look around me and everything. Oh, this is bliss. All right, now for the tarp. This is the annoying part. I'm not very good at setting it up. It always seems to sag and doesn't properly align with the hammock, so we'll see how I do. It's so nice in here. Far out. So much better than the tent. I've got my book. See, look how easy it is for me to get in because of my... Um... Your height? Well, yes. <laughs> but I meant my shoes. See? Yeah. I can just... And they're not dusty. And... Oh. So is this where I'm going to sit all night while you make the fire? Yeah, basically. <laughs> But I still feel like I'm a part of it. I need a pillow. Need a pillow? Do you want to get you yours one? If you want to. It's in the car, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> if I have one too. Yeah, I reckon, I, um, where can I put it? I reckon if we had two branch, like if there was a thick branch coming off that tree on that side, we could put them right that next to That would be so other. fun. Check out Mill's view. This is what you see when you're lying down. See all the way out there into the forest. Right, I've got your pillow. Pillow delivery service. Mm. You enjoy your book in there? Yeah, well I might just fall asleep because it's so comfy. <laughs> Alright, well enjoy it. has finally arisen and we're going to make a campfire. Put too much Vaseline on the cotton balls, now I can't even get them out. Do you bring the Vaseline and the cotton balls with you? Uh, not if I'm like pack walking, but if I'm like car camping then yeah I've got a huge tub, otherwise I just keep them in this little tube. Gotcha. It seems to be catching quite fast. Yeah. I think the past four camps we've done, everything's been like saturated, so. <laughs> you haven't got to try that that efficiently. Yeah. So much of this wood is so dead. Yeah. Well, no, all of it's dead. It's all rotted off and fallen. That's what the, all this forest is, just dead wood. 
What was that? <laughs> it's meant to be a laugh, but it came out gruffly. <laughs> You know, it would be so sick. Imagine coming out here and just like along those trees, if you were able to put up like one of those white- A projector? Yes, a yeah. white screen and you just- You could do that. That would I be- I mean, you need like a generator. Yeah, and some power. But if you generator. Could, right, okay. Yeah. But if you could do that, that'd be so fun, perfect day. People do it in their backyards. Hey, you know what I just noticed actually? I was reading in the SAS book that if you make an absolutely perfect fire with the ideal Airflow. You could theoretically make a, a smokeless fire. There's no smoke. Yeah. So I guess it's got perfect airflow right now. That would That's be... really interesting. I brought you a cherry ripe in the Snickers. Thank you. If this thing actually works. I would blow through the small one. Oh, you're right, actually. Damn, that's re actually really helpful. Sardines. Yeehaw. Do you want to try it? No. Please no. try it. Ew, 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 ew. You gotta have the oil when you're camping. You need every bit. Would you like a fishy? No. Ew, the thought of that is so foul. It makes me want to throw up. Good night. Good morning. You look so cozy. Yeah, I'm cozy. Well, what are you eating? A honeycomb muesli bar. Delicious breakfast. Hello.
pretty good spot, but you know, you can never have too many spots. Found a pretty cool area around here. It's all kind of mountainous compared to our flat area that we're on. Um, there's a road that goes up just through there. And it gets quite tall, so what I'm hoping is it's gonna reach the mountaintop and give you this huge view over everything. So I'm gonna go up there now and hopefully there's something exciting. It's kind of cool up here actually. Someone's already made a campfire over there. There's no spectacular views or anything, but you know, it, it's a spot, I guess. This is kind of a cool spot. It is along a straight road, but there's a campfire there already kind of made. It actually smells really good here. It smells like pollen. <laughs> no matter what the weather, we're together. Check out that! Oh. Hey, there's ducks! There's ducks at the back! It's very pretty. Yeah, it is. I wouldn't swim in there, but hey. Yeah, I'd be way too scared to. <laughs> Ooh, Miller! <gasps> this is a really pretty spot. It's all shady. Make a mental note. You know how to get back here? Yeah, I know how to get out. Little house together. What snack have you got? I have a few options. I can get like a roll up. Alright, I'm gonna check out the spot. Oh yeah, sick. I love when people dump their camping chairs in the bush and someone's left their top too. Yeah, it would have been so hard to shove that back in your car. And some forks. Yes, yeah, sick. Tent there, hammock there. And then you got the ducks to keep you company over here. Definitely reckon this is a spot for next time. This looks so good. It's so far, so far. This could be a great spot. There's a little turnaround, like literally just around the corner. So we're not gonna die? No, just around the corner there's a big circular area where we can do a UE if we need. But it goes further down into the valley and I can hear a gushing like river or something. We're another like 15 minutes down the hill and it's getting like pretty rocky and dodgy. So I reckon all it for today, we'll come back next time with two cars. So a little bit safer. It's so far, so far. Are you trying to press steadily creating mess? i